That's what's been going on with you guys. Hello? Oh. Hey! Is this Dean Stockwell? I can't hardly hear you. Yeah, it is. Hello? Hey! Hey! Good, good on him. Oh, yeah, don't worry. Hello, everybody. Yeah, I hope you're having a good time. Yeah. Mr. St Mr. Stockwell, can you hear us? Good. I can hear you, not really very clearly, but I can hear you. Okay, on stage right now, we have Scott Bakula and Don Belisario right now as they? we speak. <laughs> what did he say? Who are they? Who are they? Hi, Scott and Don. <laughs> we God heard that butthead. Be there. You hear that butthead? What? You... <laughs> I said, hello, butthead. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> He's a little butthead. <laughs> okay, Slimey, let me talk to Don. Okay, fine, don't worry, like always. <laughs> you Italian guys, stick together. Hey, Dean, good to hear you again. Hey, how you doing, big fella? I'm doing fine. Great. So are you. How's your painting coming? Oh, I don't paint, but I'm making art. <laughs> and it's coming pretty good. Yep, up here in the mountains of Taos. I wish I could be down there with you, but I just couldn't make it. We really, yeah. really miss you, sir. We wish you were here with us. Yeah. Um, I don't thanks. miss you. <laughs> no. Yeah, it sounds like you got a pretty good group of people there. It's yeah, fantastic. we thought about bringing you... We thought about bringing you as a hologram, but then... <laughs> CNN wouldn't release the technology. No. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we should have done that. That would have been great. Would have been cool. That would have been really cool. Mr. Yeah. Stockwell, yeah. Mr. Stockwell, can you hear me? Yes. Do you have any interesting behind-the-scene pranks that you may have uh, pulled on either Scott or Don? Oh, I wouldn't even think of doing something like that. <laughs> well, can can I ask you another question? Do you like pie? Jeez. Sorry, buddy. Sorry. <laughs> Do you like pie? I think there yes, was sir. a pie event, as a matter of fact. <laughs> yeah, we got them good. <laughs> Dean would enter the stage, and you'd hear, of course, after he got off the golf course. You remember what you would say every time he walked on the stage? That's why you took the role. That's why I took the role? Yeah, so you could play golf two days a week. Oh, yeah, well, that's a good idea. And I'm not <laughs> And that's not counting the weekend, so it's four days a week. Yeah. Do you remember what I used to say when you'd come in the back door? Yeah. Yeah? All I know is it's the best damn job I ever had. <laughs> you used to walk in the back and go, the fun starts now, baby. Here it goes, baby. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. You got snow? Huh? Is it snowing up there? Uh, it snowed uh, yesterday. Uh, no, day before yesterday. Wow. Yeah, it's very beautiful. But snow is cold. I don't know if you know that. <laughs> but then the sun came out, and the snow melts, and everything runs in these beautiful cycles. I'm, I'm glad you were, you were here on the phone, because we had some questions about snow we were trying to figure out. Well, you got the right guy. <laughs> where, where does snow come from? Over the snow place. <laughs> he's, been, he's been watching. Where they make a flake. country for old men. <laughs> I think if you're a snowman, actually, originally, Scott. I mean, you're kind of a flake. <laughs> oh, my God. You know what's really silly, Dean? We're sitting here, your voice is coming from the left, and we're all sitting here looking <laughs> at a bunch of lights on a wall. <laughs> And the voice of God. Yeah, that's right. Yes, right. Preceded yeah. by the lightning bolts. <laughs> a couple of the bulbs are off, though, if you know what I mean. Yeah. I was just thinking that I was kind of missing you, and then you said the flake thing, and I'm over it. <laughs> I changed everything, huh? 
Yeah, uh, I don't know. What are you doing? You doing another show now? You talking to Don? Yeah. Am I doing another show? Yeah. No, it's still, NCIS is still on the air, and I've got uh, three features I'm working on. Cool, man. Great. I know the next and question. And the, mag, the Magnum features uh, probably going to go. Uh, wow. Great. great. That's great. Bellastario never quits, man. I, I was thinking of you as Magnum, but... <laughs> they said Selleck would be pissed. <laughs> Why am I looking at the lights? <laughs> We're looking to where the voice is coming from. It's totally natural. What would be, if you're talking to him like this, it would be really weird. It'd be like you'd be ignoring his voice. Yeah, it'd be rude. It'd be, it'd be rude. rude, exactly. It'd be rude. I think I want to be rude. Okay, all right. Who's going to be rude? We're, right. our, we're turning our back on you. Yeah. Oh, are you really? It's a penalty for not being here. Aren't you going to ask for a job in one of the movies? Oh, sure. Don, give me a job on the movies, please. <laughs> I, want, I want all you guys to look out for a special two-hour DVD movie of Battlestar Galactica that is yet to be shown that uh, my character fairly dominates. Yeah. Good on you, man. Yeah. <laughs> What else you got? Well, I got my seal imitation. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh. Four and a half years. You want to do the other, you want to do the other part? Yeah. <laughs> Four and a half years. Should have been a lot more. Yeah. Yeah. But I couldn't get the hit out of Warren Littlefield. <laughs> Where's the movie? Ask Dean. Dean's working on it in, uh, in the mountains, in the melting snow. Yes, up in the mountain. In the cold, yeah. Up in the highlands. Where in the hell is he living now? I can't tell you. It's top secret. <laughs> they don't tell all the Battlestar people. They've taken him to remote. Is there some place near Stallion Gate? I have... <laughs> Uh, I wonder how many people remember that. I, they all are you. What do you mean? <laughs> they all do. They all remember. Mr. Stockwell, how much time do we have with you, sir? Oh, another couple of minutes. Okay. Um, we really missed you here. Oh, that's very nice of you to say that. And uh, small story here. I had a bet with uh, some members here in the audience because one of my favorite movies is The Boy with the Green Hair. Um, yeah. Do you remember exactly what year The Boy with Green Hair came out? I think it was 47. Close enough. <laughs> <laughs> Why, am I wrong? Wrong. Well, that's one of my favorites. But like I said before, we really, really wish you were here. And uh, if you could tell us uh, a little bit of uh, what your experiences was with Quantum Leap, as Quantum Leap, um, we'd appreciate it. Well, uh, you know, it's just kind of amazing that I got paid to do that show. <laughs> because uh, it was really a joy. And, of course, old slimy Scott had to do all the hard work. <laughs> I'd just come in for a couple of days each episode and have a ball. So... I have to mark it right up there with the, the finest and the best and most enjoyable jobs I've ever had. It was great, and, and uh, you know, I'll, I'll always be grateful to Don for casting me in, in that silly role, <laughs> obviously being confident that I could pull it off. Thank you, Donald. Hey, Dean, <laughs> when you accepted the role, I couldn't believe it. <laughs> You had just made you had just made Married to the Mob, I think. Yep. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. And everybody was telling you, "What the hell are you taking a job on television for?" Because you were that's hot. That's right. You were Matter hot. Matter of fact, my, my dear good friend Dennis Hopper 
And I told her about it. She said, well, that's the end of your career. <laughs> and now all these years later, Hopper's doing a series. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah <laughs> and you want it, but you, you should have told Dennis, you know, what you really took it for because you could play golf. And I know that's appealed to Dennis because I remember the three of us playing together. Yeah. And I remember putting my arms around you and he on the uh, ninth hole at Lakeside. You were arguing over the score. <laughs> <laughs> you were counting and going one, two, three. You had a five, Dennis. And Dennis said, no, I didn't. One, two, three. I had a four. You know, you had a five. <laughs> they were going back and forth arguing. I walked over and I put my arms around both of them. And I said, hey, guys, it's 1968. <laughs> Could you believe this scene? <laughs> <laughs> you remember that? <laughs> no, you were too gone from 1968. <laughs> oh, man. Mr. Oh, Stockwell, man. if you don't mind. All right, guys, listen, I'm out of here. I love, thank you for letting me talk to you. I love you all. And uh, have a ball, OK? Thanks, Dan. Love you. All right, love you. Talk to you later. Ladies and gentlemen, Bye. Dean Stockwell.